happened to show up. Well, she doesn't have anyone else. All the mean girls hate her. You gotta give her time to make new friends. But doesn't she understand the whole point of having a boyfriend is to be alone? Yeah, it seems to be a problem with the entire Humphrey clan. Uh, no. Dan is avoiding you because he thinks our parents are getting back together. You can't really blame him. Well, I happen to know they're not, so he needs to stop being paranoid. Okay, as far as you know, well, I don't know. Be nice to Jenny. No. Hey. hey, Eric, okay, guess what? Jonathan and I decided that tonight we were gonna have an Edith Head film festival. She says Edith Head, I say Hitchcock, same difference. Great, count me in. Yay! Oh, wait, oh my gosh. Oh, did you guys know that you have matching backpacks? That's so cute. Oh. Dan. Dan, hey. Sorry, I'm, I'm a little out of it. Look. I know you've been avoiding me, but my mom called from Boston this morning and I asked her point blank. You have nothing to worry about. W well, who said anything about being worried? Why would she say? That there's nothing going on between her and Rufus. Oh. Well, isn't that what you're worried about? Yeah, uh, yeah, I just, I was really convinced. But, you know, if your mom says something's going on, then that's good. Yeah, well, she usually is pretty honest about these things. A little too honest, actually. Supposedly, Sarkozy was a bad kisser. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, uh, that's a relief.